Welcome to Droppy, where we take your dumb ideas and make even dumber drawings. I'm Jacob. I'm Julia. I'm Nathan. And I'm Karina. And today on the show, we're not completing our own art. What? Huh. Ah. We're completing each other's art. What? Ah. Ah. The whole world's upside down. We're flipping everything over how, backwards. How does that even happen? I don't think it's that weird. Ah, uh, where am I? I'm so <laughs> disoriented with these changes. Calm down. <laughs> up is down, down is up. Cats is dogs. Calm up. It's opposite day. <laughs> Don't worry, Jacob. You started the intro real good, but I can finish it. Oh, actually, I can't because you have the suggestion. But yeah, that's, I do have the suggestion. That was sort of <laughs> yeah. Imagine, imagine if I had finished it, it would have been really thematic. Yeah. Pretend that Nathan is saying this part. Yeah. Use your imagination. Yeah. Imagine Nathan. Today's suggestion came from Rebecca Roney in the Droppy Patreon Discord, which you can also join by joining our Patreon. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And she said, what about a fix it and post speed draw where you take really old unfinished pieces and finish them now, or maybe trade old unfinished art? And so we kind of took that idea and changed it a little bit. We made new sketches. We made new unfinished (laughs) art. Yeah. Uh, And we didn't finish them and we traded them around and we finished each other's art to see how that would look. And I think it was a lot of fun. We did a bit of of a player shuffle here. Mm-hmm. We're yeah, not up is down, usual, down is up. We're not doing the usual order. No, it's reverse order. <gasps> uh, all yeah. My brain don't work that way. We passed them backwards instead of forwards down the line. There is a lot of thought going into this episode, and it's a little too much for me personally. <laughs> yeah, you need to be keeping track on a whiteboard of all the equations and <laughs> yeah. mathematics involved. But we're still, as always, going to start with Nathan drawing. Yeah. And the piece Nathan is finishing was a piece that I did. Yeah. And you're you're seeing it right now. I sketched out this uh, sort of handsome, evil looking dude who looks like he's got bad or sexy intentions. Yeah. (laughs) A little bit of both. You don't know what what he's got going on. You don't know, but you know he's got plans. And um, the reason I did this was literally just because I found some uh, hand reference on Pinterest of someone in this pose with these hands, and I liked them and wanted to try to draw the hand pose. Cool. I was hoping that maybe you found that reference in one of those books I lent you, but (laughs) I guess those have continued to go on (laughs) you. Don't call me out publicly like this. (laughs) Shamed on your own program. No, never shamed. (laughs) I rise above it. I'm too powerful. (laughs) Wow. Uh, Nathan, do you have anything you want to say about what you did to the sketch? Um, I mean, you'll see it. I'll I'll talk about it (laughs) as it happens. Okay. Let's freaking go then. Three, two, one, go. I wanted to try uh, something a little different than my normal uh, process for this one. So I I went with a lineless style. Ooh, cool color choice right out the gate. And I went with sort of a a monochromatic color palette, just sort of these sort of blues and cyans. And I I gravitated towards this cool like bracelet that that he's wearing and decided I wanted that to be some sort of indicator of power. Some yeah. sort of magical or alien item that, and that would be the light source for oh, the cool for the image. Ooh. And then, uh, yeah, I, I just sort of had to figure out the lighting. I, I did. I took a photograph of myself with sort of a similar <laughs> lighting, yeah, and used that as reference. But then I, oh. good thinking. I still ended up having to sort of. Uh, finesse it a little and so it's a lot of just sort of me deciding what information I want to be prominent so you'll see me add a lot of shapes and then erase those shapes and then add different shapes and erase those shapes and eventually it got somewhere that I I liked it um (laughs) <laughs> I mean, it's like really cool out the gate. Yeah. Yeah. Well, this was a cool character. I liked, I mean, you you say straight up evil was your intention with the uh, 
with the sketch, but I was sort of getting that like a little unknown motives, like definitely someone who you you probably shouldn't trust completely, but maybe more mischievous or just yeah, totally. sort of aloof. Like, like they this could Catwoman. A cat woman. Like sort of a cat woman character. Yeah. It, it seemed like the sort of person that you have to go to because you need their help because they've got like access to the the technology <laughs> or they know how to use the the magic item. Yeah. But then they maybe they betray you. You expect them to betray you, and so maybe they do, or maybe they turn out to be <laughs> Uh, they they come through for you in a moment where you you least expect it. Yeah. You don't know. Totally. Like this exact scene, this this moment is the first scene that they're in that we meet yeah. them. Yeah. They definitely just spun around in their vibe. chair and was like, "Well, well, well, crawling back <laughs> to me." For the first time, <laughs> this is the first time you're meeting me. <laughs> I know, but they know all about you. They've done yeah. their research. You walk in and they're expecting you. Yeah. yeah. Um, I do, I was hoping, Jacob, maybe the two of us could, could together come up with a name for this character, because I, I felt like I couldn't just name them on my own. Oh, yeah, totally. <laughs> what if it's like, like, Jack, or like Jax, like Jack of all trades, or something like that? I like Jack. Yeah, I like that. I'm, I'm kind of thinking, too, of like a... I, I got like maybe a Remy vibe. Oh. Remy. Ooh. Like a little bit of a. Like the rat. I was about to like say Remy rat. Ratatouille. <laughs> maybe this is Remy. Or maybe it, we combine those two and it's Jemmy. Or Jammy. <laughs> hey, I'm Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> That's how they talk, yeah. Y'all want to make a deal? I got this pretty cool bracelet. It's got powers. <laughs> they're just a really fancy looking pawn shop owner but they they happen upon magical items sometimes yeah. uh i also decided to do a little bit of like secondary rim lighting uh for the for the back good and oh yeah make totally it pop. just sort of make it make it pop and then here you'll yes. see me trying stuff that i don't end up doing but you know that's that's classic nathan process deciding <laughs> How I wanted to to do the shadows. I had Naturally. a second, a second more highlight light thing. I realized looking back at the sketch that I made the eyes. Uh, you you made them more squinty than I did, and so. I mean, I like them like this too. I think it looks a great. More, a little more open this way. A little more like ooh, 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 instead of like. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's, it's like fun to see your interpretation of like the shapes and because like when you do a sketch inherently there's going to be some spots that are a little more vague yeah just because yeah. the number of lines there now you see me messing with some <gasps> gradients yes yeah. yeah I'm just adding adjustment layers to yeah. everything <laughs> as this you do so cool. and there I'm you can see I this. I uh, I couldn't figure out because Sometimes the adjustment layer automatically makes a clipping mask to the the layer it's on, and sometimes it's uh, on everything. And so I was like, "Why is this affecting everything?" And I figured it out. It's because it didn't have a clipping mask. Still don't know what a clipping mask is. And then I decided to make that a shadow instead of a highlight. That uh, that under part there, Ooh. adding in some little details, and then again just more. Adding stuff, erasing stuff, adding stuff, erasing stuff until yeah. I That's the process. decided That's hard, I, was, I was done. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't normally uh, render stuff this way, and so I, I appreciated yeah. that. Like you, you already had such a, a strong concept with this character, so I was able to just spend the whole time messing messing about. Cool. Yeah, and I couldn't get that shadow to not look like sideburns. Yeah. So I end up, I end up getting rid of it. <laughs> yeah, we can't risk it. <laughs> yeah. I try so many, so many times, and just doesn't. It just doesn't work. And then I decide to use the reflected light instead. There. Yeah, yeah yes. that works better. Yeah, that looks so good. Nathan, you did my boy so much justice. Wow. Jimmy. So much mood. Remy Jimmy. Remy Jimmy. Remy Jimmy. 
We love Remy Jimmy. <laughs> Remy Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Um. Yeah, and then I couldn't decide if I wanted the teeth to be. Yeah, I, you know, again, just adding stuff that I don't end up using. Yeah, I'm like basically done at this point. I think I am done now. Wow. Yeah, this is great. This is awesome, dude. I what love a, the secondary light. I love the mood. Yeah. Totally. Yeah, the way you, you the light source, beautiful. Yeah. Chef's yeah. kiss. So smart. I like trying to make things in the drawing into the light source because then I can see exactly where it is. Fair. Yeah, it does help. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, this rules. I feel like you really got the vibe I was hoping for. Well, the sketch, <laughs> like, the sketch yeah. had such a vibe. You totally went a different direction with it. I feel like this dude would definitely get a redemption arc later in the series. Yeah. Maybe. When he realizes that he actually cares about the main yeah. character. And if he doesn't get a redemption arc, well, he's still a fan favorite. Yeah. Oh, of course. He gets redemption arcs in the fanfic for sure. <laughs> so many. Yeah. I mean, clearly the, my character style is just problematic fan faves. That's yep. all I draw. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, I'm glad I got to get a hand the on the ball. And people love it. <laughs> yep. Me included. Yeah, awesome job, Nathan. This kicks ass. Thank you. Yeah. Great work. Now we go to the one that I finished, which was Karina's sketch. Yeah. Yeah. Ha, 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 ha. Um, should I talk about my sketch? Yeah, tell yeah. me about the sketch. Okay, so... Um, I asked Jacob what was on his wish list for sketch things, and he just said a, a neat pose. Um, so I, I tried. I don't know. I was kind of head empty with this one, but I did. I did want to do like a. I, I got. I was in the mood to do a monster girl because it's October, baby. Yeah. So there she is. Woo. Yeah, she rules. I got this, and I was so excited. She's it's, so cute. I threw a little uh, outfit. I, I did a little outfit f for you, but. You know, just so you had a guide of what I was thinking. But otherwise, it's all you, baby. This is like a Christmas in October because it's, all, it's just us <laughs> gifting sketches to each yeah. other that we yeah. thought each other would like. But we're all in like a kind of spooky mood. Yeah. yeah, totally. Yeah, mine was a little spooky. This is a monster girl. Gosh, they were all a little spooky, huh? Yeah. yeah. Hey. I'm going to get right into it and I'll explain what I did as we go. Peace. Three, two. One, go. So basically what I wanted to see, kind of the opposite of Nathan's approach, I wanted to do very my style of rendering. <laughs> yeah. Because I wanted to just see what it looked like on top of Karina's like posing and character design. And um, so I wanted to go with like my traditional thick and thin yes. um, tapered inks and like Ooh. make it super yes. clean. Because Karina, you never really like ink like super clean? No. <laughs> um, but I always like am curious like what it would look like, you know, like if it had yeah. super clean inks. That was a thought I was having while I was trying to figure out what to draw. I was just like, I get one Jacob ink. <laughs> what am I going to spend it on? Yes, yeah, one your token. beautiful ink. <laughs> so mostly I was just having fun trying to like cuz your sketch style is really loose and flowy and energetic. And so I had to sort of figure out which parts to like keep and which parts to get rid of, um, like which lines to follow, I guess, since my inking style doesn't leave a lot of room for looseness. Yeah. It's a tight, a tight style. It's a tight style. Um, so I was Beautiful. mostly just trying to, the, the most of the challenge was figuring out how to translate your shapes into like my sort of style. Um, but it, this is mostly gonna be just inking. <laughs> <laughs> I love Jacob Inks. The hair, the way you rendered the hair is reminding me of something so specific. It's, uh, yeah. there, there used to be these bags that were really popular when I was in college <laughs> that had the little devil guys on them what? from Japan. Devil guy and, bags. And it has, it has that quality and it's driving me nuts. Devil I can't guys. remember what it's called. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, what about. are you talking about? I'm going to Google it. I yeah. will have flashed it on the screen already in the edit. Devil guy bags. <laughs> Devil guy. <laughs> oh, also, you gave me them thick thighs. Yeah. I had so much fun with that. And I got to, <laughs> I got to complete your legs also. Yes. Um, thick inks fun. on thick thighs. Yeah. That's what I, you want. 
I was just throwing down a lot of lines because I wanted to give you like a fun pose, but I couldn't think of one. <laughs> so uh, this is where I landed. <laughs> I mean, this <laughs> is a fun pose. This is fun. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, so I got to kind of extrapolate uh, the legs, yes. which I enjoyed doing because I like yes. drawing legs. I think they're fun shapes. Ah, I just love watching you ink. It, it ends up like, you know, to not, we're not quite towards the end yet, but seeing like the finished <laughs> ink, I was just like, it's really cool because it doesn't really look like mine or Karina's. Yeah, like, we transcended end. art. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it looks like someone else did it, which is kind of fun. Yeah. We've created a new artist. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who is this? You made this? No, none of us made this. <laughs> we made this? We made this. <laughs> but also, no one made this. Wow. Yeah, this looks like a dating sim. Yeah, yeah, it does. It's got like that like crisp just... dating sim vibe. It's also giving me Disgaea vibes. Yeah, I could definitely see that, like the portraits in that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I was really happy with it. I thought it, look it ends up looking really cool. Yeah, this is a good combo. <laughs> yes. I want more. I want more. <laughs> more. I want a whole <laughs> Monster Girl universe of Karina sketches with Jacob Inks. We could do that. <laughs> we can do anything we want. Yeah. <laughs> we should. Um, I wonder what we could like do if we had like an episode where we did all four of us work on every piece in different stages. Yeah, because that's oh. a thing. That's a thing that was like. I mean, I'm sure people still do it, but that's that meme where like someone does a sketch, someone does the line art, someone yeah, does yeah. the color. Yes. That'd be fun. See what I'd kind of artists so we create. so down. Yeah. Who are these people? Yeah. <laughs> it's going to turn into a Julia color challenge again. <laughs> well, you'll only be coloring the, the one. Yeah. yeah. It'll be all of us doing a color challenge. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Uh, so at this point, I'm just figuring out the base colors um, and then getting sort of the, Ooh. oh, yeah. Because it's like a mesh sort of legging and yeah. top thing going on. I'm in a mesh mood lately. It's cool. Fair. It's cool and fun. I, I've i been using Clip Studio a lot more lately, and I found a really good mesh brush. <laughs> it's the one I used on the sketch. <laughs> and now brush. it's all I want to do. <laughs> I'll cover oh. anything in mesh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like trying at this point to figure out how I want to do it. I end up going with half tone. I think that yeah. looks the best. Always looks good. Say yes to the mesh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, mesh. <laughs> yes, please. And yes. so I, I wanted to do uh, like, you know, looking down at you from atop a building sort Rim. of vibe. <laughs> and lit lit by the moon. Yes. Oh, yeah. It's, it's that spoopy month for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so I got the vibe of like, this is the first issue of the manga where the main character is like a hapless student and he's like getting attacked <laughs> by some thugs and uh, he gets saved by this demon woman yeah. who then has to like, you know, he has to make a pact in exchange. <laughs> Classic stuff. I want to yeah. get saved by this demon woman. What's her name? We need yeah. to name her. Yeah, we got to figure that out. Ah, uh, geez. Yeah, I didn't think of anything. <laughs> Did you think of anything? I haven't thought of anything. No, I'm trying to think of like what comes to mind. Well, I was going to just add on that in this manga, it from the premise and cover, it seems like a harem, like a setup for one of those harem mangas, but it's actually just very wholesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's just a, it's just a Ooh, fun time. They end up becoming like best friends. Yeah. <laughs> and roommates. Yeah. Oh my God, they were roommates. They're roommates. <laughs> I feel like it kind of has the vibe of like a, a comic book cover, like a variant cover yeah. or something. Yeah. Oh, this looks so cool, Jacob. Yeah, those look great. Thanks. At this point, I just start messing with some of the levels yeah. and like boosting the colors a bit to make it really pop. Yeah. And I think that's it. I think it's done. This is going to sound really stupid, but like the combo of like your line art and my sketch, it gives me the vibes of like the 2000 Sonic art where they're all twisty. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, yeah. You're totally right. Okay. Absolutely. <laughs> that's, that's not that's stupid. The, I agree. <laughs> that's the leap <laughs> my brain was making. <laughs> yeah. It's that era of like Sega artwork. <laughs> I think you're absolutely right. We Yay. do have to name this character, though. Yeah. Yeah, oh, man. Dahlia. 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 Dahlia and Dolly for short. Yeah. I like that. Hell yeah. <laughs> She's Dahlia. This is Dahlia, the That's demon her. who saved you from getting beaten up by thugs in the moonlight. Yeah, now she's your roommate. You're welcome. <laughs> and now she's your roommate. You're welcome. Julia, did you find the bags that you <laughs> no, were talking about? I'm still looking. We'll figure it out. Yeah, yeah I'll look, we'll I'll look afterwards. We'll, we'll add yeah. it in post, don't yeah, worry. Yeah, we'll add it again here <laughs> yeah, if we did it earlier. Here. Yeah, more. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, thank you for the awesome sketch, Rena. This was so fun to do. I love the render. This rules. This turned out so good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now it's Karina's time e. to finish Julia's sketch. Yeah. <laughs> Me. So, Julia, do you want to talk about your sketch? Yeah. I didn't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think any of us did, but. No. No. But I just kind of went and I wanted something that I thought, basically my goal was purely selfish and that I wanted something that had a me vibe, but that had a had a Karina flair to it. <laughs> so I tried to be very uh, basic and just suggestive and let Karina take over and do what she would Karina with it. Karina take the wheel. And I just, I started drawing and I came up with this this weird sketch. <laughs> I did it. I got the Julia Green sketch. <laughs> yep. Everyone dreams of the day that they receive yes. a Julia Green sketch. <laughs> this is the neatest green sketch I've ever given anyone. Such a spooky man. I wanted a, I was in a spooky vibe. It's October. Yeah. I wanted a Julia mood. I wanted a Julia setup and a Karina dunk. <laughs> Hell yeah. Alley oop. Yeah. Alley -oop. Uh, anything you want to say, Karina, before I get going? Um, not not really. Get into it. Got to talk for seven minutes. Let's go. All right, let's go. Three, <laughs> two, one, go. Uh, yeah, so um, I, I kind of wasn't sure if I wanted to purposefully not do this the way I think Julia would or if I wanted to lean into the Julianess, and but mm. I also did this kind of last minute, so uh, it, it ended up where it ended up, but... I, I was handed a, a Julia man and I went mm -hmm. buck wild. I did want to make it a bit a bit for Julia, so I did want to make yeah. them. <laughs> Christmas nice and in cute. October. Yeah, g give him some problematic vibes. Yeah. Where He's I landed, getting hot. Yeah, He's where getting I landed so with hot. this sketch. Because I, I was just sketching in like, okay, this is how I think uh, this is going to go. He landed very... Uh, Adam skate the infinity. <laughs> yeah, well, that he wasn't very Adam skate the infinity. That wasn't on purpose, but I guess you you set it up, and that's where I dunked. That's a gift for Julia. Yeah. So yeah. Um. So I did just draw draw him in, and then I uh went back to the sketch later. But I did just want to draw in a dude. Uh, like I said, I've been working a lot in Clip Studio, so I wanted to do this one in Clip Studio because I like it a lot. This is not sponsored. I bought the program like a year ago. I'm just finally <laughs> now using it, and I really like it. <laughs> Deal with Fair. it. Yeah, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I just, I just wanted to draw a Julia Handsome Man. Yeah. I was given the chance. <laughs> I, it's it's interesting to see where you went because I definitely made him very like ghostly and vague. Yeah, I I, I still wanted to like be ghostly with it, but yeah, I figured I'd get into that in the color. Uh, yeah, and just like I, like I said, I didn't uh, did I say I didn't have a strong idea of where I was going with this. So this is like the base, and then I I went from there. <laughs> but oh I did I did want to like get that good lighting and shit in. Yeah. Um. Sorry for flashing. I, I'm not good. <laughs> I'm not good. I feel at like all using of these come with a flashing warning. It, it's a given at this point, but yeah. just so we're clear. So, then I just flatted in some stuff. 
Let Ooh. me go look nice and cool. It's looking so cool already. Wah, wah, mm-hmm. wah, wah. Do you end up re-severing the head from the body? Or... I got to be honest, I didn't read it that way. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I missed okay. that part. Shit. Oh, my God. I look stupid now. <laughs> no, no, I like don't. it. Don't worry. It, don't worry. No. We'll get there. <laughs> it, 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 the neck grew back. Yeah. yeah. I missed that. He reconnected that. his head. Fuck. <laughs> it's just behind the collar. Yeah. yeah. It's still severed just behind the collar. Yeah. I don't know. I get, like I said, this had like Adam vibes and like uh-huh. uh, I, I guess her, I... I landed with it as he's some sort of spooky demon, sort of spooky guy. He's a spooky oh, yeah. guy. Oh, he's yeah. a spooky yeah. guy for sure. I mean, he's obviously a he's a spooky guy. Oh, but, um, yeah. And cool. God. So I just so wanted cool. to make him look real spooky and like smoky. He gave me uh-huh. smoky vibes. Yep. <laughs> a little Definitely smoky smokey. the bear over here. Just to make him <laughs> look nice and nice and mysterious and a little otherworldly. Just a I've- bit. I've heard of Smoky Eye, but this is ridiculous. Hey. <laughs> so. I feel like this dude's turning around to make a deal with Remy, who's also making the same face <laughs> back at him. <laughs> it's a lot of back and forth. Yeah. That. <laughs> like, who's in charge here? I don't know. <laughs> it's Someone not else Remy. Walks in and they're like, yeah. "What's happening? Do you guys so, work together?" Or? Yeah. So that that this is still just me kind of setting up the the base of the whole thing. I wanted him to be all spoopy. It um, feels like I'm making a deal with the devil. Yeah, that's kind of that's kind of what I was going for, I guess. <laughs> oh, you and Remy um, make a perfect team. You got a red guy and a blue guy. Are they the red and the blue? They're the red yeah. and the blue guy. Fuck. Oh my god! This is yeah. like red and blue, but make it problematic. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Don't really want to root only. for either. Yeah. So Ooh, the thing painting. I like the thing I like about Cliff Studio and why I've been doing it is because I really like painting in it, which is just something I've never enjoyed doing in Photoshop. So I I wanted to do a little bit of painting, so it wasn't just like boom boom flat. Uh, I, I wanted it to have a bit of depth. <laughs> so um, <laughs> uh, yeah. And I just like, I like painting in faces. I think my favorite part of the body is the underlid of the eye. <laughs> yeah. yeah that's I really a good part. love to render in the underlid of an eye. <laughs> it, it's really fun. I like, I enjoy that yeah, too. Yeah. It adds so much. Uh huh. That under part of the eye tells you a lot about a character. So, yeah. yeah. So I was just. How tired doing, are they? Doing a little gentle bit of lighting. It's it's kind of weird because where I ended up with this is that the lighting is both really hard, but also like really soft in the shadows. But I don't know. I just thought that looked neat. I think that's so, so cool. <laughs> yeah. And then and then I didn't do that with the body because that's annoying. So. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and I feel you. There are no under lids on the body. Yeah, what's the point? <laughs> what's even the point then? <laughs> this is so cool because it still has like totally Julia vibes yeah. to it. It's a Julia composition with yeah. Karina awesome effect. Oh, I, God. Oh, my God, the purple. <laughs> this is so dope. <laughs> I couldn't not like, I, I was really considering like going somewhere weird with the shadows because you gave like a really dark like kind of that noir noir ish also this is where i did a weird effect because i thought that looked cool oh and, yeah. yeah uh but uh in the end i couldn't think of anything better so i just i just stuck with it no, <laughs> and i really i i like it 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 Felt cool. I felt very cool doing like a Julia style dramatic color. <laughs> <laughs> no, this this is so sick. This but rocks. Yeah. I love. This. I just wanted to make him look kind of ghostly, so I got in there with them sweet, <gasps> sweet uh, effect oh. brushes and yes, use this one that looks like light but also looks like smoke, and then I I softened down the like bits that look too much like light and yeah you make a deal with the devil and you love it <laughs> yeah I'm, I'm going back to clip studio yeah Holy i just smokes. think it's neat i'm having a great time learning it not sponsored <laughs> not sponsored i spent my own money <laughs> <laughs> i need you to make a list of all the brushes that you use so i can I just download, download them. random free ones 
Yep. I need to know which ones. <laughs> okay. So, <laughs> okay. <laughs> we're doing the thing that every artist hates to hear and then also wants to know, which is which brushes do you use? <laughs> <laughs> I go to top free of the week and I just download whatever looks neat. <laughs> <laughs> this looks so good. Yeah, yeah this, this is this is your boy. Rips. Is this your man? <laughs> yeah, yeah, he sure is. God, what's, I love all the effects. What's an evil derivative of Adam? <laughs> Oh, that's a good question. Well, Adam is a biblical name. What about like yeah. Cain? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Damn, he's basic. <laughs> I want you to know that when you said an evil derivative of Adam, the first thing that came to my mind was Alan. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, Cain not... Allen. He's got a full name. That's how you know he's bad news. <laughs> he's bad news, Cain Allen. Stay away from him. <laughs> Don't make a deal. Alan, the evil Adam. <laughs> <laughs> it's just my dad's name. <laughs> and he's like an evil Adam. He's basically like an evil yeah. Adam. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is awesome. Great yeah. work, Karina. Thank you. It's amazing. That means we got one more. It's Ooh. me. It's Julia drawing Nathan's sketch. My yeah. sketch. Oh. So let's take a look at Nathan's sketch. We've come back to hands. Oh, Ooh. Hands. it all comes back to hands. You also looking at hand refs? No, I was just, I just wanted to draw some hand. I just wanted to draw something creepy for Julia to have fun with. Bro, yeah. these hands are beautiful. Yeah, you by the way, it on these hands, dude. Thank you. <laughs> I, you know, I didn't go full spider number of uh, of limbs. I got to six and was like, I can't figure out where to put these last two. So it's just a. It's not a full man spider. It's just I feel, a. I feel like it'd be less unsettling if it were eight legs. Okay. Yeah, then That's what you'd expect. Spider. Yeah, exactly. This is a very unexpected thing to mm -hmm. see. Yeah. As evidenced by the character dropping the flashlight. And I tried to keep the background oh. vague so that Julia could, you know, do whatever she wanted with it. Yeah. Well, let's see what she did. Let's get into it. Three, two, one, go. Okay, so I, I'm i still trying to figure out my way of doing digital painting. I might just switch the clip studio. I might just steal that from Karina. <laughs> it's Only just, Karina it's does always, that. It's always fun to try things out. I know. Uh, yeah, I might do it, but for now, I was trying a new way of painting in uh, Photoshop, which is very not how I work, which is using the big soft round brush wow. and just building. And um, what's hard about this method is that you get to a ugly stage that you think there is no returning from. <laughs> yeah, totally. Yeah. And then you got to keep going. Somehow you're like, I got to trust the process. <laughs> this ugly thing's going to turn around. I swear uh, it does at some point, but it, oh boy, it goes through some ugly stages. <laughs> yeah, um, that's art. That's a that's lot process, of yeah. digital painting, probably just yeah. regular painting. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, so I've this heard is, it's like when it when you hate it the most, it means it's like yeah, uh, like a three quarters of the way done, basically, or something. Yeah, it's just it's just usually people don't see that step. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, yeah, we hide it. Yeah, absolutely. So I was blocking in the basic shape, and I'm trying to do the thing that you're supposed to do in painting, which is to start big and then narrow into details. So you do like you know the the general gradient yeah. of an object first to figure out like the base of it, and then keep building shadows on that and highlights and things like that. Um, but I wanted this guy to be crawling through like a snow, a snowy area, because this guy's all bundled up. Oh, cool. That makes so, it even creepier because it's naked. Yeah, he, he naked. He naked in the snow. That's how you know someone's a freak. <laughs> <laughs> Just a freaky guy. Just a freaky guy. <laughs> You know, a woodsy freaky guy. This is the evolution of the dude who wears shorts and sandals in the winter. <laughs> yeah, this is what they become. <laughs> My nemesis. 
Um, but yeah, I'm just, like I said, this style of painting is very new to me. So I took it kind of slow and I do a lot of jumping around in this because I'm unsure of what I'm doing. Uh, this is me. I want the flashlight to be on, obviously, like this person was walking through the woods and then saw this and dropped it, yes. which is where all the light's going to be coming from. This very pointed light source. Oh, my yeah. gosh. Oh, my gosh, Julia. Yeah. So because it's snow, there's also going to be some some bounce this is, bounce there. You say that this isn't like, this is very new to you, but it's beautiful. Yeah, I this like is, you. oh, the shadows. It's cool to watch. Yeah. This is everything I hoped for and more when I yeah. made this sketch. Make this the next creepy pasta monster. <laughs> it's probably an SCP out there that's this. <laughs> um, this is basically an hour and a half of a trust fall for me and my own <laughs> process. <laughs> Did That's you okay. catch yourself in the end? I don't know. It remains to be seen. Stay seat. tuned to find out. I actually do <laughs> like how it how it turns out. So, I, but there was I definitely like a stage where I was like, out. "I gotta dump it. I gotta <laughs> dump it. It's bad. <laughs> <laughs> this is bad. It's not going anywhere." Uh, but I learned a lot from doing it. Uh, yeah. I think we're getting closer and closer to a painting style that's more effective for me. Every time I do one of these, so that's good. Um, this is me making it warm, so I'm gonna get that little outline, that little warm outline of the oh, light. Oh yeah. This is kind of reminding me of your um, like Octopus Boy Dark Souls boss. <laughs> the Love Actually yeah. Dark Souls. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. Go back and watch that episode. It's yeah. a hit. <laughs> it's a hit. Everyone said, this is what you should be doing. Yeah. yeah. Well, this is what we asked for. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that lighting is beautiful. Yeah. Thank you. I was oh very happy gosh. with how it turned out. Oh, my Photoshop broke at some point, <laughs> and it just started making lines. <laughs> I was very confused. Yeah. I had to close Photoshop and restart. It was, it was doing the Be Gone brand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Heard us talking about Clip Studio. So I got yeah, mad. I was like, shut up, shut up. <laughs> You're trying to replace me? Let me show you reasons why you should. <laughs> Crashes <laughs> makes only lines. <laughs> Oh, I gave him, um, originally, since I thought this would be a snow creature, he would be kind of immune to snow. And then I decided that he is still kind of human. So I gave him um, frostbitten fingertips. Yeah. Oh. This is guy who wears sandals in winter. <laughs> yeah. It's not even that cold. <laughs> this is what I think and feel whenever I see a dude in New York City wearing <laughs> flip-flops when it had snowed a lot the day before and has to go through all of those like ah! those, the slushy corners. <laughs> yeah. The sidewalk. Yeah. Wow. I'm glad uh I'm glad you were able to take this and make it very personal. Yeah. To yes. your experience. Oh, when the when it catches the light. Genius. Oh, yeah. Highlight oh, yeah. snow. Some kicked up snow from this creature just like kind of like coming towards you slowly. This is cool. Thank yeah, you. this is beautiful. What a collab. Yeah. It's like, yeah, because back, back in the day, uh, Julia was doing all my drawfee renders for a while. <laughs> so this is a nice throwback to that. Yeah, when they all looked like this. <laughs> <laughs> I made them all nightmares. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, I wanted him to be kicking up even more, yes. like that loose top coat of snow, you know? Yeah. That happens, so he's he's kicking some of that up as he's going through, or the wind is, and it's kind of yeah. blowing in between his the only his good limbs. part of snow. Oh, noise! Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. This there's looks so there's cool. Your boy. There's your boys. This freaking rules. <laughs> What's the name of someone who wears sandals after the big snow? I f uh, Todd. No, this guy, no. his name is something like. <laughs> <laughs> it's Fisher. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but they call him Fisher. <laughs> yeah, they call Fisher. him Fisher. 
<laughs> yeah, Fisher's good. Man, this turned out so good. Yeah. Hey, really everyone watching, leave your creepy pasta for this for Fisher. Yeah. Down below. <laughs> yeah. Let us know what Fisher do. Yeah. Make this the next thing. Draw Fisher kissing Siren Head. <laughs> I saw Fisher kiss you sing siren head. Wow, it really is Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Wow. Well, this has been us finishing each other's drawings. Yeah. I think it ruled. Yeah. yeah I liked that. I want to do that again. We'll do it again. I think we should do the four person one. Yeah. yeah that'd be a lot of fun. Yeah. yeah. And, um, <laughs> And and if you liked it, maybe you could go to the Patreon and and show us you liked it with the money that you give us. <laughs> maybe. Maybe. And that could also get you in the Discord where you could m put your suggestions. Maybe we do them like we do with Rebecca Roney. Maybe, maybe. Yeah. No promises, though. Mm -hmm. Look directly at them. Yeah, if you want to make a deal with Remy to get your suggestion picked. Yeah. Yeah. Or Kane. Or Kane Allen. You gotta say both names. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't like and subscribe, Fisher will come for you and do whatever it is that he does to you. Mm -hmm. That has yet to be determined. Yeah. But yeah. will be determined by the comments below. It'll definitely like touch you with those frostbitten hands and it'll be super cold. Yeah, that's guaranteed. Ah. <laughs> Lots of touching happens. Yeah, so if you don't want that, like and subscribe. Go follow us on Twitch. Go buy our merch at DFTBA. E. That's it. We love you. <laughs> okay, We're don't sorry. get carried away. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sorry.